Bringing Christ to the Nations and the Nations to the Church. Daily Devotions from Lutheran Hour Ministries. Sunday, November 7th, 2021. Jerusalem the Golden. Today's devotion was written by Dr. Carol Geisler. It is based on the hymn, Jerusalem the Golden, which is hymn number 672 in the Lutheran Service Book. Jerusalem the Golden, with milk and honey blessed, the promise of salvation, the place of peace and rest. We know not, oh, we know not what joys await us there, the radiance of glory, the bliss beyond compare. O sweet and blessed country, the home of God's elect, O sweet and blessed country that faithful hearts expect, in mercy, Jesus, bring us to that eternal rest, with you and God the Father and Spirit ever blessed. We know not what joys await us there. As much as we long to be with our Lord and to be reunited with our friends and family members who already live in His eternal presence, we really don't know what heaven will be like. Holy Scripture speaks of streets of gold, gates of pearl, and walls built on a foundation of precious stones. We may picture green pastures and still waters enjoyed under the eternal care of our Good Shepherd, or an Eden restored where we will walk with God. Yet the joys that await us there are beyond our understanding. But as it is written, What no eye has seen, nor ear heard, nor the heart of man imagined, what God has prepared for those who love Him. How can we imagine a world without sin? What would it mean to live a life that is not bound by time? What can we grasp with our God-given, although limited, understanding? We know what God tells us in His Word about the place of peace and rest. The Apostle Paul longed to depart to be with Christ, for it is far better. To die, to fall asleep in Jesus, is to be away from the body and to be at home with the Lord. Our heavenly home provides a Sabbath rest for the people of God. To be at rest and at home with the Lord, we can hardly imagine anything better. But there is more to come. When Jesus returns on the last day, the saints who died before us will be raised bodily from death, and we will all be transformed in glory to live in His presence. We care for our earthly home, yet at the same time we understand that we are exiles here, and we long for an eternal home that we know will be far better. It is a home prepared by our Lord Jesus, a home purchased by His blood shed on the cross and confirmed by the Holy Spirit, who is the guarantee of our inheritance until we acquire possession of it. The Apostle Paul contrasts the earthly Jerusalem, which represents our former slavery to sin, with the heavenly city. The Jerusalem above is free and she is our mother. Jerusalem the Golden is a place we have never seen, but it is our hometown. Although we do not know everything about our future home, we know what faithful hearts expect. The day will come when we will be at home forever with the Lord. Joy awaits us, and bliss beyond compare. Will you pray with me? Lord Jesus, keep me in your care until I live in your presence forever. Amen.